Hey guys, and welcome to Petroped, and welcome to this week's Midweek 180, brought to you from the luxurious surroundings of the Purple Palace in Manchester. Yes, I'm up in Manchester this week on work, but I couldn't not bring you my Midweek 180. If you've not seen one of these before, this is my Midweek update where I bring you my news, views and information about upcoming reviews all filmed in one take. I'm going to put 180 seconds in the bottom left hand corner of your screen and that's it, a very simple format. So without further ado, let's get cracking with this week's Midweek 180. I shall start my timer. Okay, leader of the pack last week was the Speed Machine 35. <laughs> well done, sir. But the famous five were Noisy Man X, uh, Gibran Somra, James Yowell, and Roger Pope. So, whoever puts the first comment this week, you will be my leader of the pack. And the top five, you will be in my famous five. Now, where are you and what have you been doing? That was Ian Holborn, who was skiing in Lecht, Austria. Please stop telling me you are skiing. I'm missing out. But wherever you are right now and whatever you're doing, please put it in the comments below and I will give you a shout out next week. Now, last week's question was all about basically what your F1 predictions were going to be. And I think it's safe to say we all got it massively wrong, <laughs> especially me. But more on that later. Uh, this week's question uh, actually comes from my mate Humphrey Bradley. Um, but uh, you will have seen, and I talked about it last week, the new AMRB003 from... Aston Martin. Now, uh, all Aston Martin cars begin with a V, apart from the DBS Superleggera. So uh, basically, what do you reckon the name of that car would be if it started with a V? Your suggestions, please, in the comments below. Uh, now, uh, F1, I was up bright and breezy. I had my alarm set for 10 to 5 at the weekend, watched the race live. And I have to say, hats off to Bottas, absolutely sterling drive from him. Didn't see that coming. I honestly thought Ferrari were going to dominate, uh, but they were they were beaten by Max Verstappen and Red Bull. Um, so really, really a uh, big show up for the books, but brilliant from um, Bottas. Still have no idea why Hamilton was pitted when he did. I know they said it was covering off um, uh, Vettel, but it screwed up his race completely. But brilliant for Bottas. Um, and uh, what I did quite think was interesting was it seemed that the cars could follow each other much better than they have been in recent years. So that holds us some, hopefully in good stead for some of the races to come. Uh, now, new car uh, or new cars on the horizon? Well, it has to be my new car. If you see my announcement on Monday, yes, people, I am getting a Mini GP3. I basically put my name down for one uh, last week. If you haven't seen my video, I'll put a, a card above. But yes, super excited. It's not going to hit the channel until January. But yes, the new Mini GP3 is coming and I'm very excited about any of the information that's slowly leaking through to me. Um, another quick announcement, hopefully you saw my uh, unusual Tuesday night video from last night about my meet and greet which was due to be this coming Sunday. I have had to postpone it. Please watch my video card above for the details but basically due to overwhelming demand, Goodwood, I spoke to them and we just basically there were over 500 people had said that they were going to turn up and the current set up at Goodwood because of members meeting build up just meant we didn't have enough car parking space and it was going to be potentially a real nightmare so I, I had no choice but to postpone. I will be looking for a bigger venue uh, and I will be hopefully reorganising that venue very soon. And then this Friday's video at six comes from Donington Park with my enduro car test from the weekend and that my dear peddlers is that. <laughs> yes, so Friday you've got to tune in Finally got behind the wheel of the little Ford K, Ford KA, Ford Cap. Love to. Which? What do you say? Ford KA or Ford Cap or Ford Car? Um, yeah. So drove that at the weekend at Donington. Absolutely brilliant little thing. Our first race is only three weeks away, so you need to tune in. Uh, on Friday to see how we got on with that little thing um, and that is that um, I'm going to draw this video to a close if you have liked this one please give me a thumbs up comments below are always welcome and if you haven't done so already please subscribe to Petroped for plenty more content to come the next of which will be this Friday at 6 for our enduro car testing but please also my meet and greet is postponed please spread the word for me let anybody know who you thought might be coming huge apologies from my end please watch my video I explain everything in that but I just had no option on this occasion. But I will see you on the next film, guys. You take care. Drive safe. <laughs>